Dr. Theodore Henderson with Neuroluminance Brain Health Centers coming to you once again. An exciting topic today. I want to talk to you about the potential of infrared light therapy to help persons with autism. The autism spectrum disorders covers a whole lot of territory. We're just going to call it autism here. And so there has been international research going on over the last few years about the ability of infrared light to help reduce the symptoms of autism. So a study out of Italy, uh, two studies out of the US, another study that's coming out fairly shortly uh, from Europe using low power infrared light devices that sort of fit on the head like a headband. And what they're seeing after, you know, six, seven, eight weeks of treatment is that some of the symptoms get a little bit better, a little less of the anxiety, a little less of the aggression, a little less of the odd behaviors. By parent report, there's only one problem. As soon as they stop doing the treatments, the symptoms sort of come back. And this is the difference between low power infrared light therapy and the multi-watt infrared light therapy that Neuroluminance provides. Um, our therapy, LUMIT, which stands for Laser Unattenuated Multi-Watt Infrared Light Therapy, LUMIT, okay, it's easier to say that, is um, actually getting through the scalp and skull and into the brain and directly treating brain cells. We're seeing early in our work with uh, patients with autism is uh, reduced anxiety, um, improved cognition. Uh, parents are saying, yeah, I don't have to repeat myself to the child over and over again. They get it on the first try. In fact, we have one patient who had psychological testing before treatment and psychological testing after treatment and his IQ went up. So that's pretty exciting. He's now beating his dad at chess, much to his dad's uh, begrudging, but there you go. So some exciting stuff going on in the world of autism, a new potential therapy using light, infrared light, the fifth branch of medicine. So stay tuned, more to come. This is Dr. Theodore Henderson signing off.